I know this song isn't definitive, but I feel like it has some content that can be considered for Halloween. You know, some of the major things of what we think Halloween is today in our modern day is, you know, disturbing or scary or scary movies and guts gore. Basically anything that has to do with um, what scares us, fears, stuff like that. So most people are going to be watching ha Halloween movies, scary movies, playing scary video games. I know I will be. Um, uh, listening to scary music or disturbing music, kind of like I am doing now. So this song, she. First of all, I've got nothing against Tyler the Creator. I think he's an okay artist, but I'm not too into his music. And to be honest, that doesn't mean I completely hate the guy at all. For instance, I actually really like this song for the disturbing kind of content it has. I sort of see it as an Eminem song. You know it's kind of joking, you know it's kind of weird, but at the same time, you can't help but to feel a little creeped out about it. Golden rubbers in these denim pockets. On my waist, there's a black glock. New girl moved on the block. She been plotting on my brown cock. Seriously, the basic thing about the song is that um, whatever character uh, Tyler is playing is eyeing this new girl who moved in on the block, and she has a boyfriend, obviously, as you can tell, but he's so adamant into being with this girl, obviously. So he'd go to great lengths to get to her. This even means attempting to murder her and her boyfriend. Like I said, just listen, the character he plays is so believable and adamant that you can imagine like someone like this going to great lengths just to be with someone that they feel that they want need to be with and he envisions this entire life for them. So like I said, um, the guest artist really does ring out the, the best in a song most of the time. So what we have here is the hook done by none other than Frank Ocean. Wide open so he can see. <sighs> see, like I said, it's so believable. Like you just just someone outside of your window watching you as you sleep. And it, it could be during the night or like in a video, it's kinda like during the day, like afternoon. Like you're resting from work and there's just this guy creepily lingering over you and just watching you sleep. That's disturbing. You're sleeping alone, babe. Check your window. Swag. Is that your window? I'm gonna be honest. When I first heard this song, I physically looked out my window. Cause um, when I first heard it, I was it was at night, and I literally looked out my window. Like I guess it's that basic human thing. I know there's nothing wrong, obviously, but. Like, when people tell you, you know, when you're watching something at night and it's very calm, it's quiet, and you're thinking, oh, nothing you get me, then, like, it's like, oh, well, look behind you. And you just had that basic human instinct to just look behind you. It's really a disturbing thing. See, when I'm with my friends, I just put on the front, but in the back of my top, I'm writing songs about we. We is including I and yourself. Make See, what did I tell him? Has the whole life planned out for them? by himself and her just basically being his child maker. <laughs> Ew, wow, you actually killed this girl? Or is she screaming? Oh. Oh, she's screaming because... Damn. Okay, I get it. Sorry. <laughs> 